Fighting has erupted between Armenian and Azerbaijani forces in the disputed Nagorno-Karabakh region. Both sides accuse each other of having started the hostilities. And both Armenia and Azerbaijan have reported civilian deaths. It's the latest flare-up in a conflict that's dragged on for almost 40 years. Nagorno-Karabakh is in the South Caucasus. It's internationally recognized as part of Azerbaijan, but is controlled by ethnic Armenians and backed by Armenian forces. As a result, the remote region has become a de facto breakaway republic. The near 40-year-old conflict stems from the way the borders were redrawn during the breakup of the Soviet Union, with both Armenia and Azerbaijan claiming Nagorno-Karabakh as their own. In the early 90s, hostilities between the two neighbors led to a full-scale war that killed more than 30,000 civilians and ended with a Russian-brokered ceasefire in 1994. Since then, there have been regular skirmishes in the area, but the latest flare-up has been the most violent in the last 20 years. The conflict has international ramifications too. Russia has traditionally supported Armenia and provided weapons for its military, while Azerbaijan is a major oil exporter to Europe and is backed by Turkey.